shock with the sudden death of Karen Carpenter back in 1983 due to anorexia nervosa. Her brother Richard, the other half of the group, which had produced dozens of hit songs, became a virtual recluse. It's only in the past year that Richard Carpenter has resumed his recording career, and now he's hard at work on a made-for-TV movie, tracing the life and times of his sister and the Carpenters. In a modest house in the suburbs of Los Angeles, not far from where Karen and Richard Carpenter grew up, the tragic story of the late pop singer is being filmed for an upcoming movie of the week. Well, there it is. How come you're hogging the trophy? I still can't believe we won it. Well, you can see it in the living room. Well, Richard, don't take it. Mom says we're going to fill the whole place with awards someday. It's almost a little surreal at times, just to see uh, actors and actresses as the two of us and recreating things that happened many years ago. Uh, it's all a little bit... Uh, it's exciting, and it's unsettling also. Such a feeling's coming over me. There's wonder in most everything I see. And for the actress playing Karen, having Richard as executive producer has helped her prepare for the role. He's added some insight. Meeting his parents has helped a lot. Being in their home. I wear Karen's clothes. It's, um, it's been really interesting. As painful as it sometimes has been for Richard to be involved directly with this project, he says he wouldn't have it any other way. This is our lives. I mean, this is how many, many people are going to remember Karen and me. And uh, that's why I'm trying to do, along with everybody else, my damnedest to try to make it as, as accurate as it possibly can be.